Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the gradient of a curve at a given point. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concepts. In the first example, we have the function y equals 4x minus 3 plus 2x to the power of negative 5. We have to find the gradient of the curve at point 0.16. The first step is to find the derivative or the y dx of the function. Note that the gradient of any line or any curve is a change in y over a change in x. So that the y dx at that point will be 4 times negative 3, that's negative 12, x to the power of negative 4. Then I have plus 2 times negative 5, that's negative 10, x to the power of negative 6. Because we've been given the point 1 and 6. So at point 1, 6, the value of x is equal to 1. So we need to find the corresponding y values by inserting x equals to 1 in our expression. So we have dy dx equals minus 12 x is 1 to the power of negative 4 minus 10 times 1 to the power of negative 6. That will be negative 12 times 1 minus 10 times 1 to the power of negative 6. That's 1, which is equal to minus 12 minus 10. Therefore, the gradient of the curve at that point or at point 16 will be negative 22. In the second example, I'm going to do the same. I have the function or the curve y equals to 3x to the power of 4 minus 4 minus its x to the power of negative 3. The first step is for us to find the gradient, that's the y dx, so that we have change in y over change in x equals 4 times 3, that's 12x to the power of 3. The gradient of the constant, that's the y dx, will be 0. Then I have the gradient or the, the y dx of minus 8x to the power of negative 3, that's plus 8 times 3, 24, x to the power of minus 3 minus 1 minus 4. Therefore, we have to find the gradient at the point 443. Note that at this point, the x value is equal to 4. So I'm going to replace my x with 4. I have my dy dx equals 12 times 4 to the power of 3 plus 24 times 4 to the power of negative 4. We have that as 768 plus 3 over 32. So therefore, the gradient of the curve at the point will be 768, 3 over 32. Thanks for watching. Bye.